You can't really see me because I'm driving and I have my phone just kind of like mounted in front of me. But I just finished my very first CrossFit class. Today was probably the most intense activity I have ever done in my life. We did three sets of a whole bunch of stuff. It was like chest workouts, squats, burpees. Burpees, like burpees. I don't remember doing a burpee since I was probably 13 years old in grade eight. And then a 400 meter run every set. It's so embarrassing when it gets to the point where I'm literally the last person running and he, I get there, after like at the third set, I finally get in and he goes and the instructor goes, oh my God, Dan, I love Dan. He's like, oh, George, like that was really good. He's like, did you make it before or after the, like the beeper? Cause we were being timed, right? And I go, I didn't hear a beep, which means I made it way past that beep thing went off. I was like, I didn't even hear it. Keep in mind, I went in today with no knowledge on what CrossFit really was. Because I've never done it before. I've done everything with, you know, at my own pace. I shut the god, I leave, I leave. <laughs> Wait, like, what are you doing? Fun fact, really, really sad. Oh, no, 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 no. No, no, no. What do you think I'm gonna say about this? Um, put it down, put it down, I swear to God. Julia eats I don't this know raw. What you're about. She opens this and eats it the way it is. Okay, this time we have to check. Okay, Make fine. sure they're not crying. Why don't we play a game where it's a surprise? Oh, that's perfect. Well, are you gonna grab it? Okay, so this is really good. What is it? Um, it's Daya chive and onion cream cheese. It's dairy free. Okay, just, where do you put it? Um, on my bagels, gluten-free bagels, it's good. Oh, okay, okay, I believe that. And then I get the dairy-free, um, this is the vanilla pine. I what put is this, the, what is this, yogurt? It's just like yogurt, and I put like granola in this, so this is very good. The great Houdini. And today, for my trick, I'm gonna make these rascals cry! Cry! <laughs> So we're gonna first start off with, with the setting spray. Talk to me, goddammit, or I'll throw you in the fire. Oh my god! <laughs> this one. That actually smells amazing. It smells really good, yeah. So the next for, yeah, just like George said, for breakfast tomorrow, I like to have the dairy-free silk yogurt. It's the vanilla flavor. It's it's very good with granola. Okay, that's enough. And the last thing that I got was Daya. <laughs> George! Israeli and Post. Israeli and Post. Small double double. Sounds good, baby. <laughs> Can we go to Hikiti Do that, baby? Give me a kiss. Love you, baby. Oh, I look. Hi there. Can I have a hi kitty doodah, baby? Oh, a small double double, baby. Can I get one black hot coffee? Hot coffee. What did I say? Hot. Yeah, one small double double, and then one large black coffee. Oh, sorry, one medium black coffee. I'm not trying to be that caffeinated, baby. Thank you so much. Okay. Wanna go to hi kitty doodah, baby? I need to watch this. Hold on. On TikTok, knows like the trend of like all the boys wearing gray sweatpants, and why do they wear gray sweatpants? Um, because a little thing pops in. What little thing? So I've been meaning to find like shorts, like fleece shorts, like gray shorts that go up to maybe like exactly probably like this length. So but, those are cute. But Julia, I think they're kids. It's only nine. No, it's not. Are you sure? Trust me. The nine. ones that I'm looking for <gasps> online are thirty-five dollars. Oh my god! Look at that fit. Oh my god. <laughs> Julia. Yeah. Hi, can you do that, baby? Are you done? First off, why are they so boot cut? Yeah, but they're so like comfy. Wait, wait, wait. wait, I'm what you call pooped. Sweaty in areas where sweat normally doesn't form. Michael's already made his way up the hill and I'm yet to even begin because a tubster like me needs to catch his breath. Let's go. Keep up the good work.
there he goes this guy's like i'll wait for you five minutes i go excuse me i was like this guy had a half an hour break and here i am having you know not even two seconds to catch my breath and breathe This must be the fourth or fifth dose of testosterone that I have taken since I've begun my second steroid cycle. I just put all that testosterone juice in my body. This shot of testosterone today went very well. The last one was, I'm not gonna say the last one was painful, but it was just a little more difficult because my arm was just tensing up. It was a little more stiff than today was. Good evening, folks. Has everybody so super excited they're just so amazed and they're just so enthusiastic to watch me take my anavar all right so i have my three anavar tablets here i'm gonna take these i have been consistent with these anavar pills these tablets every single day so let me show you guys on camera rooney me basically taking advil but well i mean it's not advil but it's like basically watching me take tylenol or something oh, man i just have this like crazy migraine i should probably just take a couple tylenols Much better. This is the last day of week two body measurement updates up until week three starts this weekend. I mean, I'm still chunky dunky, but my stomach is like slowly forming the chest. I've always been really happy with my chest. My arm, even look at that. Like, it's like there's a bubble in there. Like what? Okay, enough of my body. Okay, let me suck you out now. Okay, now let's measure what my body is. This thing is so dusty. Do you like see that? 195. I'm actually so impressed. Like, wait, what? Week one, I was 189. Like, that's what I measured at. I better be hitting 230 pounds with lean muscle, huge arms. Week two has come to an end. Let's go on to week three. Let's eat more protein. Let's get those gains. Let's grow these legs. Let's grow these arms. But for now, everybody, this is the end of this clip. I will see you in week three. TTYLs.